When I first got to Britain from Swaziland in 1982, I went. Uh, I got here in April, and I went straight to the festival that summer uh, because of its legend. And I saw the Glasgow Sits Company, um, at the Assembly Rooms, do an astonishing performance um, that I will never forget. And people talk to each other in a way that's uh, it's much more sociable and communal. That's the charm of it. So go with an open mind and an open wallet, and then you'll have a good time. <laughs> I was remember being the audience of one for something, um, but that didn't seem to stop people at all. I thought that was extraordinary. You know, it's unique. I don't think there's any other festival like that. The autobiographical film that I wrote and directed, Wawa, was premiered there at the film festival in 2005. So um, I feel very indebted to uh, the festival for believing in it and me and in having my film launched there. We've got so inured to the amount of media that we're saturated with. Every trailer you see the entire movie, the synopsis of, of a book you're given on the fly cover, so that you're swamped with this information. So to go to Edinburgh and hopefully find stuff that you know nothing about, uh, that's the great adventure of it, and I love that.